This is a little space that, that we like for our surgical patients that have to be here for, say, an entire morning. Or if we have patients starting surgery at one o'clock and they may be here for three hours or four hours for the afternoon. And so they have their own space where they have coffee and some snacks and television if they want, a little personal computer that they can uh, basically uh, surf the web. This is a nice little uh, space for patients that have to be here for more than the, the usual office visit. I'm happy that I have reminders of my family everywhere I turn in this office. I have some very personal spaces where they're just filled with pictures of children. I have four children and my wife is uh, of 30 plus years now, uh, has been an integral part who is always the backbone of my family and also uh, my heart. But one thing that I love that, that she's done is we renovated this building so many times as we've grown over the years. And this used to actually be a, an outdoor hallway coming into the back door. And so we converted that into another a whole area of, of, of operative suites. And so we had to take something with the windows. And so my wife uh, creates glass art. And these are windows that, that she has put together and, and it gives it a little nice uh, soft touch and, and one other window that I'm real proud of is another one that she did and I'd like to show you. So we opened up this office area, which is a central area, and, and uh, there's a transom above this small little space where we have one of our physician assistants. And uh, it's nice that I can sit at my desk and see a window that my wife uh, painfully but um, happily uh, finished after some time. It was a quite a, a labor of love that she uh, put together for me and I'm so grateful that I can uh, see uh, touches of her everywhere I turn, not to mention her uh, picture which is always beautiful and children surrounding me everywhere I go. And If that's not enough, I, I have great memories of uh, what uh, brought some dear friends uh, here, and uh, one of them is uh, the children's home that we that we sponsored for 25 years now, and, and now there's a second generation of children, and they they've taken care of um, uh, 30 uh, children that that uh, for one reason or another, or any number of circumstances where they've lost parents or they were abandoned by their parents, and so. Uh, uh, dear family uh, started this children's home, Oasis de Amor, uh, 25 years ago now. And that was a, an honor that they gave me a picture of, of the first generation. And now there's a second generation of children that are now uh, uh, continuing to grow and thrive uh, in the uh, southern part of Honduras.